um, you're going to be put in a small defensive position, two foxholes defended and fortified, and you will be holding these foxholes against an enemy assault. Obviously, um, you guys are going to be expected to take casualties, and your goal is to hold uh, your defensive position for 10 minutes. During this time, yes, some of you will go down, so yes, make sure you are prepared to provide medical assistance. Um, if at any time you feel as though... Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey boys, you can get yourselves like kitted up uh, based on the scenario, but let me finish the briefing. Come on over here for a sec. Just so you guys are aware, while you are going to be expected to hold these two foxholes, uh, if you feel that you are being overrun, there is a secondary defensive position that you will be allowed to fall back to so uh, you feel as though it's uh, needed, um, where you can continue to defend your position and provide medical care. Um, but yeah, after uh, your basic objective is do not get wiped out within the 10 minutes of the continuous assault. Is that understood? Yep. Yes, sir. All right. Yes, sir. London. Death will be a factor here, gentlemen. Prevent it as best you can. Um, I will say this much this scenario. The primary thing that we're going to be looking for is your ability to save each other's life um, and not put yours unnecessarily at risk at the same time. So, yeah, keep that in mind. This operation will also be during the day. Uh, so, just keep this in mind in terms of suppressors and uh, the rest of your equipment. Alright, we're just nice to ready up and. Uh, Thomas uh, Winter over here. Wait at the uh, helipad when you're done. I'm just, uh, I'm gonna grab extra medical supplies if that's all. Yeah, um, Thomas or Winter, one of you guys grab a 203 with at least 50 203s if possible. What was that? Grab, grab, well, one, of you, one of you guys grab a grenade launcher. I'll, I'll, I'll grab my uh, 249. Oh, okay. Thomas, you can do that. And He's Thomas. And, uh, Thomas and Winter, both of you guys grab an M72 law. They weigh nothing and they're very easy. M72 law? Okay. Yeah, it's it's, uh, it's a single fire weapon. Um, so bad guys, fucking, if, uh, one guy in yellow team, grab a grab a 249 or a 240, all right, with a fuck oh, shit. of ammo. That, that was my bad, I'm so sorry. Oh, what happened? Oh, Christ. <laughs> Zeus. Yeah, I got it. Poor Thomas. I am. I'm hurt. My chest is nearly gone. Uh, Widmer. Thank you. Wait, so you want me to grab a M2? Uh, yeah, so, so, uh, wait, who's talking? Uh, yeah, uh, grab a M203. So basically, grab an M4 with an M203, or you could grab the M320 as a secondary, if you, if you'd rather. I can put a PEC-15 on my law. Hey, I'm still bleeding out. Can you like give it to me? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, same. Uh, Wilson yeah, and Wilson. Uh, uh, Rick Zavis. And Rick Victor. Thank you. Rick Victor, Zavis. Anybody else need to heal? I'm gonna take my suppressor off. Uh, I was playing Arma two yeah. days earlier, and you opened your inventory with G, so I just yeah. I, 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 I told I told this faction leader. Really. Who here wants to do something very sneaky, as in, as in, uh, mortar sneaky? I got a 40 Mike Mike HE grenade in, so that should work. Yeah, grab like, uh, grab like at least 15, 20. Like, mm. fucking max out, baby, max out. I do have a question. Could I grab some Hunt IR? No, no. And mm -hmm. then I need to pick up probably a thousand thing of blood. Oh, I took like three, three, th or three thousand. So, guys, when we get there, okay, very fucking simple. Before anything, does anyone, everyone here have the crutching tools, right? Yeah. Yep. yep. Okay. What we're gonna do? We're gonna get there. We're gonna set up a CCP. All right, with one guy manning it. Who wants to be the medic? I can be medic. Them. Okay, Whitmer. Make sure you have a fuck ton of medical supplies. All right. You're gonna be the lead yeah. medic. You're gonna stay at said CCP, change to green, and have a. Uh, uh, Exavis, switch to red. 
Widmer, Swiss Trick Reed, you're gonna be the lead fucking medic. You're gonna be at the CCP, doesn't matter what the fuck you happen, you're gonna stay there until someone gets knocked down. If someone gets knocked down, you're gonna fucking run to his mission, bring him back to the CCP, treat him. Uh, CCP stands for what? Uh, Casualty Collection Point. Okay, you're, thank you're, you. You're, you're basically gonna be like 50 meters or 100 meters away from us in case he goes down. If someone goes down, you're gonna bring him back to the CCP, treat him until he gets back up. Got it. thank you. Uh, uh, when you're unrelated, I suggest this. talking to Zeus for a designated medic role if that's interesting. Uh, you I, I, it. I know your skills. Thank you. Yeah, I am interested actually. Uh, well, right, talk to before Zeus. we start this, I have somewhere around 45 grenade, uh, okay. grenade rounds. So. Here, I'll actually. Wid Widmer, I made you a doctor, okay? So you can, we'll be able to stitch people and do. Uh, yeah. well, shit, alright? Uh, I do have a quick question. Yes. Uh, um, so, um, what's the difference between all the, the, uh, bandages, packing, field dressing, and elastic? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Sure just, make sure, just, just make sure you have a surgical kit, okay? Surgical and kit? Surgical kit, yes. So basically what happens, uh, so what I need you to have is, uh, fuck ton of bandages, surgical yep. kit, morphine, epinephrine, and I'm missing something, uh, and blood. A fuck ton of blood, alright? Alright. Uh, and... That's for everyone. Make sure everyone has said medical equipment because if he runs out, he'll use yours by default. In case you didn't know. Uh, I think. Um, but for your question about the bandages, I think packing bandages are for large wounds because they yeah. can pack the wound. But but what what what, what when I say doesn't matter. It's just that you just yeah. want to fucking deal yeah, with. You just want to you just want to bandage them quick so you can stitch the wounds up. Okay. Uh, as quickly. My, so basically, in case you didn't know, it's uh, in your medical menu. It's the little uh, advanced treatment button. It's gonna say like. Stitch wounds or some some bullshit like that. Uh, we'll, we'll see if I'll pop up. A quick addition to the medical thing: elastic bandages stop bleeding faster. Yeah. I've noticed that I've used I've used elastic bandages pretty universally. Um, yeah, I've used that. field dressing on my. Yeah, the, yeah, listen yeah, up, yeah, people. Yeah, listen up. Listen up. Listen up. So once we drop in, we will have one minute to prepare. So let's start. Okay. Let's yeah. start doing that now. I like thinking about our plan here. So Raymond, um, well, like Widmer, said, you guys, everyone has entrenching, correct? Yes, sir. Yeah. All right. So Widmer, you're going to be doing the CCP. Um, yes, sir. Raymond, do you want to assign someone else to start yeah. building up that uh, fortification? Thomas, you have a 203. Yeah, so Exavis, you're going to help yeah. Widmer. And basically, you're literally just going to make a fucking circle, all right? Like maybe uh, 50 meters from the from the uh, the position. A circle, maybe with a hole in it, so we can drag people in if necessary, or what? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly, with a hole in it. Uh, the... So, so basically, basically, you want the hole in the back, not in the front. Okay. Like um, like and then, the... so am I supposed to? Am I gonna run to you guys to help pick up bodies, so you don't have to use some uh, an extra rifle exactly. just to? Exactly. Yeah. We're, we're so you're call like out. the designated medic. Out. You're gonna run to. Okay. Uh, just quick. shout medic at the top of your lungs, and I'll come running. What's that, yeah. Richard? Yeah. No, I, I want to do tell Widmer that in case if you run out of medical supplies. I have uh, 10 morphines, 10 FEs, 5,000 mi milliliter um, blood bags, 5... Two, that reminds me, I need more blood. Uh, um, can I, can I but, take but a... Wait, 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 the thing is, though, with, with medical, is that you will use their medical supplies before you use yours. Yep. So, okay. Uh, yeah, so yeah, literally, literally they, every my sh my shirt, I guess my pockets, my backpack, and my vest are full of just crap. Back, so ensure that you uh, have you know, basic needs as well. So lots of ammunition. Yeah, I have I have tons of extra ammunition. So if you guys need some, I've got five extra mags. I have my bag. All right, I have an extra canteen to too. Good to bring some water too. I have oh, I have two canteens as well. So if you guys are if you guys' guns are cooking off, let me know. So no, no, uh, quick okay. question for you guys: what, what scope would you guys suggest using for this? Because we are probably going to be engaging maybe long it's range. It's CQB, and so I'd stick with like a red dot arm, like something very oh, small yeah. but very visible. I have a uh, GSM tri Jacon AccuPowered with a T1 canted sight because that does every single range right, that I've ever needed. I mean, yeah, that, that's the one I have online. Um, yeah, I don't, th I don't find the use for any other sight right, really. Right, quick, 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 guys, hold on. Thomas, you, you, you're good to go. Yeah, I'm good to go. All right, uh, Xavis. Uh, one second. Oh, by the way, guys, don't forget. Uh, Zeus, I was told to come and talk to you about a designated medic role. Since. Uh, yeah. he, 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 you know, Zeus, he, he's talking about, like, in general. Like, not, not. Like, I already gave him your medical permits, but he meant, like, in general for. Oh, okay. For after. Oh, yeah. no, Wilson did, actually. Not you. Oh, 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 wait. Wilson, were you talking about in game from perms? Yeah. No, I'm speaking of yeah. designated medic as Yeah, 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 in, yeah, in general. In general. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, that so was something we talked yeah. about uh, post-examination because that's 
like I, I made, I just shoved it down Remy so that we weren't gonna worry about secondary specializations until the exam was up. But afterwards, yeah, I've already had some like ideas about who I want. Uh, Moses, we're Look gonna talk to. We're gonna have a meeting probably uh, soon yeah, with the man, so Remy and right. everyone else. So just, sure I just letting you know. That's what matters, really. Yeah. I'm not sure the exact time, but it, it, he'll DM you and whatnot. Okay. Wonder. Oh, All right. So is um, everyone ready? If you guys are ready, oh, to the uh, all Wilson. I'm ready to make hmm? things go. Uh, let me check this. Why is there like a bunch of augs on the ground? What the hell? Yes, it is. All Thank right, you. Great. I accept that. Uh, That's awesome. Also, Thomas, you'll get this though. So like uh, the two or three before you decide to take take down. Okay, I gotta get more tourniquets real quick. Yeah, Um, basic. I'm gonna um, take I'll less. Do that. I'll do that next step. Okay. Need ton of these bad boys and a ton of those bad boys. That should be enough for like two, three people at most. Oh god, I hope it's enough. I thought well, you were a German. Well, German, but I live here for like 11 years, so. <laughs> I am, I am in, indeed a British citizen after all. Yeah, I noticed your accent. You you were, I noticed like yeah, British I, accent. I have a German nationality, so I have a German passport and I also have a British passport. Yeah, that's super cool how that works. Oh, and I have a Hungarian passport as well. Dual Hungarian. citizenship then? Or no? Tri, uh, tri citizenship, yeah. Lamal. <laughs> Sorry, Zeus. You guys ready? Uh, wait till Lyman's back. No. no I'm back, I'm back. We're good. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's blow things up. Am no, I? Yes, accept ourselves. Zavis on me, please. I don't want to, like... Just a reminder, you have one minute bad. to prepare, and then the assault begins. Yeah, it was an accident. That which, wait, which normal. direction will the... Yeah, thing South be coming South. from? Everywhere, everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> oh, okay, well, if I'm supposed to be in the back, where am I supposed to be? Uh, oh, okay. Um, right here. No, it's a foxhole, so we don't want to do it. <laughs> Raymond, uh, Widmer, where am I supposed to be at? Yeah, over. Right here. Make, uh, yeah, uh, you and uh, someone else, like Zavis. Zavis. Make a make, make, make a circle of. Uh, you know how to use trenches. the trenches, right? right? Yeah. Are they? Are they? Yeah. So only only big, big trenches. trenches. Only big trenches. For I'm one. making one right here. Make one to my left. Make it relative. Make it compact enough so I don't have to worry about Russians coming up on me and eating okay, so me, eating me alive. We're gonna be on the north, west, northeast one. The other teams are gonna be on Too bad the I don't have like Ridmer tall walls there. or anything. So guys, let's uh let's fucking get her going. Get her going. Fortify the back with trenches if you guys can. Wilson, are you making a trench? Yeah, you are. Yes, I am. Everywhere, everywhere. All right, I got the next trench off of you, uh, Wilson. You see where mine is? Yep. Okay. We're making a diamond again. Oh, make sure to leave a hole as well, so we can drag bodies in. Not to worry about trying to jump shit. So like at directly to our south, uh, I think. Probably the, 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 uh, Actually, I'm gonna run my compass right now. Just hold out for ten minutes, right? Sorry. Just hold out for ten minutes, right? Yep. Yeah. Ten. Christ, I'm nervous. I am too. Dude. Yeah, you are. Oh, I'm fucking terrified right now. Yeah. They're Russians. The I'm Russians? They're not even. They're not on IRA anymore. I think they might be Russians. Hold on. This is good right here. You can drag uh, people. Uh, uh, can I only dig so many entrenchments? I can't see any my entrenchments anymore. Sorry, just don't. It's whatever. This is how it's gonna be. To be honest, you're pretty good at it. Think um, so? Yeah, I wish. Is it like right here? Yeah, it's really not easy with those. Well, on each side of us, we've got wide open fields. So. Yeah. So this is not. This hey, might Thomas, not be the we'll best idea, but it's what we have. So we don't get off guard, we're hey, do you have? Uh, can you make one more? So uh, where? Right here. See where this wall goes really low? Well, this, you need to drag people in. So. Oh, oh, I thought the hole was over here. No, because you're going to get piped. <laughs> okay. Just like wherever the wall gets low. Hold on. Yeah, you, yeah. you can drag people over things. It's not a problem. Okay. Is it Russians? Do you know? I'm not sure, uh, actually. I'm I pretty think. sure it might be. Uh, all call signs, this is Widmer. Make sure to take off your suppressors so your weapons don't cook off as easily over. Oh, Christ. The assault Enemy begins. Coming from the southwest. 
210. And I'm by myself on this side. Should have made my CCP right in between these two foxholes because I'm actually defend. I have actually have my own front right here. Oh, I'm actually contact 120. Um, I'm holding my own front. I'm gonna start holding my own front in a minute here. Yeah. Uh, I can't hear you. What are you saying? Uh, my entrenchment tool broke. I don't have any more trenches left. You guys are gonna have to move it yourselves. Where is Richter? Over. Need help? Can you hop over? Brent. Okay, okay, coming for Richter. Which uh, which direction? Which foxhole? You need help? I'm working on Raymond. Someone drag him. Richter's down. The playing splint. I need. To, I meant to click uh, tourniquet. There you go. Tourniquet on your left leg. Tourniquet on your other leg. Tourniquet's on both your legs right now. Quick clot in your chest. What do you have on your chest? Oh my God, you're gonna pass out. This is like the shittiest fucking position to be there. Yeah, I know. All right, your chest is fine. You're no longer bleeding. Um, Raymond's already down. I'm putting elastic bandages on your legs. Christ. I'm still working on you. Um, putting an elastic bandage on your other leg. You'll be fine here in a minute. Alright, uh, pl pl uh, plugging an uh, IV in your leg. Removing tourniquets right now, you'll be fine in a second. You're in pain. I think you can cope with it though. I'm not sure. Alright, checking your pulse and whatnot right now. Alright, checking your pulse. Contact to the right, to the right, 180, 180, 101. Uh, I'm injecting you with morphine in your arm. Alright, you're good to move. Where is medical needed over? Next voxel. Alright. Alright, cover me in three, two, one. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna pick him up. Got him. Alright. Picking up and right now. Alright, I'm up. I can't crouch down. Don't let me get hit. Alright, I'm bringing him up. Pull him back, pull him back. Let's go boys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Bringing in injured, bringing in injured. Give me cover fire right now. Give me cover fire right now. Covering fire, covering fire. Give me covering fire right now. Covering fire. Alright, Rick, you're, you're with the best medic right now. I'm gonna get you situated. Alright, bud. Alright, so it looks like you're uh, bleeding. Um, I'm gonna apply a tourniquet to your leg. And then I'm going to quick clot it real quick. Um, so your leg is fine. Your body is fine at the moment. Um, you lost a lot of blood. 
you receiving oh he has no heart rate which direction is the secondary uh, uh, position we're gonna stay here we're gonna stay here Raymond. Yeah, 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 copy. Uh, Tom, Tom, straight north straight north all right bud straight north I'm going north Auditor, I'm right by. I'm right next to you, man. All right, Rector, I got you, man. You're gonna be fine. I'm gonna save you, okay? I'm with you guys. How much? Uh, how far north? Cause I don't even see it. Okay, I'm moving. We're gonna keep you protected, bud. Okay? We're gonna save you. You have no pulse. Your body's fine, um, as far as I'm aware. Um, I'm going to commit CPR on you until I can inevitably save you. Um, I need to pop you with an epi, I think. I need to check your triage card. They were putting a CPR on you, right. even though your I'm body was bleeding everywhere. Uh, Copy that. Go ahead and run ahead. Auditor, make sure they're not running up on our six. Our, si our flanks are fine, I think, for the time being. So just walk backwards. God, I hate leaving them. Where north? Yeah, I see the. Uh, you just follow the woods. Uh, yeah, you it's it, yeah, you see it. Just keep follow. Uh, just keep going north. You'll see it. You'll uh, probably catch up to me first, though. Over. Come on, Richter, stay with me. Don't die on me. Do not die. Raymond stab. So it looked like they were trying to commit CPR on you, even though you're bleeding all over the place. So I stopped your bleeding. Um, I'm, I think you were stuck with an IV, but your heart rate's not going, so it's not accepting blood. Um, so that's the next thing I'm going to try to do. Um, I'm going to drop you off here. Um, so there's three of us here. Uh, here we have um, quite a bit of medical supplies upstairs. It's in a medical box. Uh, copy of that, Thomas. I'm approaching your position right now. Um, I'm going to find a suitable place to be dropping off this wounded man. And uh, probably gonna head back to see if I can't help the others over. You want me? You want me to stay here? Damn. Okay. All right, stay with me, uh, auditor. Yep, I'm staying here. All right. Um, perfect. Wide open room. Make sure they're not coming through the door. Thomas, I'm on my way back to you with help with any casualties. Negative. We're moving back. All right, checking your pulse, bud. No pulse. I'm assuming. You have a you have a high heart rate. Okay, I'm sticking. I'm gonna stick you with uh, morphine right away. Um, let's see here. I gotta say, oh man, you're bleeding too. I think you got shot in the way out. Um, Richter, I'm going to apply a tourniquet to your arm. I think it's actually just a cut. Large avulsion. Oh man. Okay, you're fine. I'm gonna get you. Um, looks like you accepted you 200 ml of. Saline, um, large amount of blood. I'm gonna give you a uh, 500 millimeter C where that gets you first because I don't want to waste my thousand quite yet. Um, taking your tourniquets off. Um, it doesn't even say that you're in pain, so I'm not gonna stick you with the morphine quite yet. All right, removing your tourniquets off your body, and you should be awake in no time, buddy. Uh, dream a little dream of me while you're sleeping, okay? Um, yeah, you're fine. You're in no pain right now. Uh, you haven't even been given any kind of help. Um, check your blood pressure. It's probably going to be low due to no blood. Um, 80, 53, that's low. That's relatively low. Um, your pulse should be higher though. Um, 158, so that's pretty high. Uh... So I'm going to stick you with some morphine, see if I can't get your body to calm down. Um, you're still accepting blood, which is good. Um, I'm going to check your pulse again. Um, 149, so it's coming down very slowly, very slowly. Checking your pulse again, 144, so your pulse is coming down pretty slow. Um, and you should be awake in no time, Richter. All right. Alright, what's the, uh, do you see him out here? Yeah, far out. 
Uh, what's your uh, bearing? Uh, I'm looking about 194. All call signs, this is Thomas. Um, uh, I'm carrying Xavius back down to the second position. I need someone else to come up here and grab Raymond. Uh, he's down by a tree. Alright, um... Can anyone else in that pos current position come and get you or no? Over. Auditor, go over there and go help him. Yeah. Taking heavy fire as well. Sending, uh, uh, sending auditory your way at this moment. He's going to go get the, the extra casualty. I'll try to cover you as best as I can from my uh, position up in a roof. Over. Alright, buddy. I'm going to check on you real quick. Uh, uh, tell auditory to wait. We're going to have to go together. There's, there's a lot of enemy contacts. Copy that. That's for you and auditor to figure out. Heart rate of 80. Your heart rate's pretty low. Uh, I'm gonna check your blood. Um, 120 and 80. Okay, so let's save us die. Damn. Um, I'm trying not to risk myself. Where's Auditor? Uh, Auditor just went your way. Uh -huh. Auditor, um, this is Widmer. Try not to go too far. Thomas is looking for you. He's coming from the secondary position, so try to look out for Thomas coming back from the secondary position. Over. Copy that. I'm trying to get this friendly see on the ground. Alright, I'm gonna check how you bar, bud. Um, I might actually give you an F and F friend just to help you wake up. Um, let's Wilson's see. Wilson's dead. 54. Wilson died. Damn. Uh, I'm gonna give you an epi just so you can wake up. Your heart rate went all the way down to 54. Um, that's barely enough to stay awake. Uh, check your pulse. You should be starting to go up just a little bit. 58, yeah, it's starting to go. Raymond died. Damn. Raymond just died. Damn, I'm hit. Richter, uh, waking up right now would be an amazing time to do so. I just, ah, damn. I just got shot my arm. Secondary position is being attacked. I am under intense fire. Over. We're on our way back. We lost Freeman. We are actually taking grenade fire. Watch yourselves. Watch yourselves. Coming. Coming fast. Coming fast. They are really accurate. Get in here fast. Yeah, I gotta work. I gotta work on myself too. Raymond left him. All we have to do is hold out for a little longer, boys. Just a little while longer, boys. A little while longer. Over. All right, I'm fine. Damn, another grenade. If you need it, medical supplies are upstairs in a box. All right, I'm going to pick you up, Richter, and I'm carrying you upstairs. We're gonna go have some fun upstairs, okay, bud? Gonna need you to wake up real soon. Carrying Richter upstairs right now. Not a good spot right there. Alright, Richter, I'm gonna put you in this little side room. See if you can't have some fun in here. Alright, uh, checking on Richter right now. I'm stabilized, giving myself uh, blood. Okay. Is it? Is everyone else down? Uh, yeah, basically. Wilson is dead. Raymond's dead. Damn. Running upstairs. Yeah, we're all upstairs, holding all right, out right let's now. See if I can't fuck these guys up. Alright, your heart rate is stabilizing you, bud, so you're gonna be just fine in a minute. Checking pulls, I'm gonna pop myself some morphine real quick. 100. Popping morphine. So I don't have to deal with the pain. Alright, right on your left, Auditor. Looks like they have a FOB set up over there. Yeah, well, no, hold on. Oh, no, no, that's just the rock wall. Watch out. Way too far. Nice. Good hey, go. It's a lull in the storm now, is it? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go check. Uh, make sure one of you is at least one of you is watching the stairs. Yep. 
I got the fucking uh, interesting. All right, you're receiving blood. I'm gonna check your pulse. Keep in mind, the wind's blowing about two knots to the west. Thank you. All right, your heart rate is at about 58. All right, I'm gonna cross under you. Your blood pressure should be normal, maybe high. That's hella low. Um, I'm gonna give you 500 millimeters more blood. Um, just to see where what? I can get you. Oh, never mind. I was in my house. I was like, well, who the fuck is playing a piano? Checking pulse. Do we have anybody downstairs? Yeah, we got contact. All right, I'll be out there in a second. I'm popping uh, Rector some uh, F and F to help him wake up. We can have another rifle with us, too. Uh, it's just one guy. You should be good. Okay. Damn. What I'm mostly worried about is people running up from the forest. Yeah. This is Woodmer, all call signs, and you are not in the secondary position. Do you read over? Yeah, we're it. Yeah, we are. I, I, I literally ran back for every single person that died on my shoulder. Damn. Well, your fear is confirmed. There are people in the woods. Yeah, I'm worried about them being in the woods and sneaking up the, the stairs. Hey, stay still. Let them get pretty close if you have to. 67, alright. Victor, you'll be waking up any minute. Try not to expose yourself too much. I can't. I don't want to have to be dealing with uh, too many people not being alive anymore. We got enemies in the field, um, south, southwest. Don't walk in front of me. I got one of them. Alright, that was, that was, it was just two of them, I think. There's more in the field over there. Alright, I'll try to make sure. Uh -oh. Are they firing at us? I hope, swear to God. How are you doing? Hello, boys. Hello. Is it over? Yes. Oh my god. That was amazing, guys. I have kept Richter stabilized. I don't know why he's not awake yet. Let's see. Let's check his thing to see. He should, he's fine. I think his blood pressure's a little low. Did you give him some epi or plus I did. Yeah, check his triage card. Gotcha. I feel bad the rest of them died. I couldn't take care of the rest of them. No, I, we died. Me and, uh, I was, uh, it was, Raymond it was died a... because uh, we left later than you guys. We should have pushed out all together. Yeah, I tried, mm -hmm. to, I tried to go back and get you guys, but you died on my shoulders. I got a grenade launcher to my head, like directly to my head. Yeah, and I was yeah, dead. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to yeah. teleport everybody over. Yep. Did you give him a morphine while he's uncaught? What? Hey, Raymond. Oh my god. Welcome back. Richter, why aren't you wake up, dude? This isn't nap time. How long has Richter been out? Pretty oh, much this entire know. round. <laughs> there he is. Did he get Zeus healed? In the fucking face with an SVD. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how you weren't like waking up, that's kind of annoying. Uh, I, I don't I, there is a glitch with um ace when you don't actually wake up even if you're stabilized. Yeah, you were completely stabilized to like that entire time. Like as soon as I got you, like you were fine. You are the best fucking medic I've seen. Just so you know. I love his sweet, calm whispers in my ears when he's here. Yeah. <laughs> he kind of came off a little bit creepy because he said that he's gonna bring me to side room to have a little fun. So. <laughs> you just carried him upstairs. Wouldn't you? You're recording, right? Yeah, I recorded the whole thing. So to debrief from that off, uh, you guys did uh, pretty damn well for those two survivors. at least. Um, the only real issue, uh, as I'm sure you guys are, have already called out, the only real issue I saw with this uh, section was your movement from the primary uh, defensive position to the secondary one. Uh, as I saw you guys leave in a staggered group, I'm not sure. Was that intentional or was there a lack of communication? 
that was intentional. We said that we were, me, Raymond, and I believe Thomas were there together. We were going to leave earlier because we were still engaging contacts, trying to provide them uh, cover, but that didn't work out in our favor. So you guys were supposed to leave earlier, then why'd you leave second? No, we left later after, because we were firing shots down range while they were moving, and we got caught up with something. I forgot what, but I'm pretty sure we got hit with a few things, so we were trying yeah, to they got provide self aid. Some sort of explosive, and I ran up and like Wilson died, and then uh, Raymond died. Yeah, so we were giving, we were doing self aid, and while try, trying to provide cover for them while they left, we got caught up in the back, so we had to move earlier. We were engaging contacts directly in front of us, so. Yeah, that's fair. All right, well, yeah, just uh, note for the future, you guys are a team. I know you guys will, you split into two different groups for this one, but just remember, especially with like a big movement like that, while you are under fire. Uh, do not, you know, leave people behind. It's probably better to move as a larger group. Um, spreads out the fire, so it's not going to be like three guys uh, taking concentrated fire. It'll be the whole squad. Weird as it sounds, it'll mean that like there's going to be less uh, bullets directly on you. It's going to be a little bit more spread out. That gives the guys a better chance. On top of that, that also means that, you know, if one of you guys goes down, there's a better chance that someone's going to see it. And they're going to be able to take care of uh, that one person. And you'll also have additional people to give them cover while you move. So yeah, those are my only notes for that one. Um, overall, uh, you guys did really well, though, in terms of repelling that assault. I think I sent about 50, 60 guys at you in total. Um, and you repelled, like, the majority of them. So good on that. Um, and yeah, that basically concludes the medical uh final section of that um and then let's see uh so yeah take uh take uh take five cool off your weapons reload your kits and uh we'll move into the next section sooner than later what is that next section going to consist of so